All right, today what I want to do is this quick little Neuron Writer tutorial. And specifically, I want to talk about the export feature. It seems to be something that a lot of people are missing when they finish up optimizing a blog post. And here's what I mean. So let's say you're in your content query. You go ahead, you click on that content query, and you open up Neuron Writer. Uh, what you'll see is this content editor menu. And when you start working with Neuron Writer, you're going to be pulling NLP keywords out of here and then using either Neuron Writer to create the blog post or you'll go out to another tool to do it. So everybody always closes this editor menu. And then they go out, and in this case, let's say we're writing about why blogging is so hard. So let's say that I'm an SEO writing.ai and I've created my blog post. I've used the NLP keywords from Neuron Writer, and I'm going to copy this, and then I want to bring it back over to Neuron Writer and paste it in. So I do that, and of course, I'll just throw a title in here, generate the title. I save and close. So anyway, I'm not really worried about the optimization score here, but this is just something I want to point out. Let's pretend you've went in, you've pasted this uh, article into Neuron Writer, you've went in, you've optimized it the best that you can, and now you want to export it. And what I mean by export is you want to take this data right here, all of this, and take that and copy it into whatever your content management system is or blogging tool. So maybe you're using Squarespace or Wix, or perhaps you haven't connected Neuron Writer to your WordPress instance, or in my case, I use Ghost. I've got to get this data over to my content management system blogging tool. Now, even I was guilty of this for a long time. I would simply go in, I would just select all this and copy it over to Ghost, which I happen to use. But that's not really the right way to do it. You'll lose some formatting in a lot of cases, and it just doesn't work out well. And the problem with the interface is, unfortunately, you would hope to see, you know, the export tool readily available right here in the interface when you finish your optimization. But a lot of people forget, and I have done this as well, and that's that the editor menu closes. And I've either closed it when I open up the content query, or sometimes it will automatically close. So just remember to open it up, and this is where you would export and copy this editor contents. And the reason this is important to know is when you open this up, not only can you pull out the formatted text, which you would use if you were going to transfer this over to your blogging tool, for example, but you can also pull out raw HTML, minimal HTML, even custom HTML. And you can even save this as a Word document if there was a reason to do that, you could do it. So understanding that these export formats are here for you is a great thing. But in 99% of the cases, you're going to click Formatted Text. So now it's been copied. And now it's copying this and it's pulling everything in. And it's pulling everything in formatted as it should be. So you click OK. In this case, I'm going to go to Ghost. I'm going to go over to a post that I'm started here, and I would just go ahead, copy it in. And of course, when I've done that, it's preserved all the formatting, it's preserved all the images. Everything is here, ready for me to go ahead and publish this. And so that's all I really wanted to mention, is that you've just got to remember about this editor menu being closed, and you'll find export right here. And it's really important to note this too, uh, I've had people ask me about the plagiarism tool. How do I check for plagiarism? And they just completely forget about this menu. But if you do happen to have Neuron Writer and if you've purchased it uh, at a level, I believe it would have to be at the gold level, you do have plagiarism checking as well. And that tool is in here too. So you just have to remember about this editor menu and you can easily export your optimized blog post. You can check it for plagiarism. So that's it. That's my short Neuron Writer tutorial. I've had enough people ask me this question 
that I just thought it was worth doing. I just think people forget exports in this menu. It's easy to miss. So I hope you found this helpful. Until next time, take care.